Hola mis amores. I had actually ordered two candles softened with white woods. <laughs> this sounds like a hug. Nobody's taking pictures of plants, Papa. Hola mis amores and welcome to another vlog. Today it's I think gonna be maybe the beginning of a weekly vlog or maybe this is gonna end up being a daily vlog. However, what we are gonna do is move me into my new bedroom. Guys, I'm so excited to finally have a space where I can sleep, where I can meditate and just kind of be at peace. Excuse the noise, y'all know Kinshasa vlogging is noisy. Um, but yeah, as you can see, I have my bed here, I have my mattress, I should say, here. I have my bed frame here, and today we're gonna get my bed set up. And I hope it gives you some inspiration for the new year that you get to zhuzh up your space, make it your own, get creative with it. So let's get decorating. Hola, mis so I'm gonna first put down a clean cotton waterproof mattress protector it is a mattress protector it's like a cover so it protects against like bacteria dust mites fluids and I got it because of just those very things I just want to make sure that as I am in a new setting I can still assure that myself that I will be <laughs> continually protected against those animals and things so that's what I'm gonna lay down first and then I'm gonna put in my fitted sheet I'm gonna put in my bed sheet and my blanket I'm using a bed sure waffle blanket and I'll show you guys when we get to that but let's just get it done So this is the blanket I'm gonna be using. It is a waffle blanket. I actually saw another vlogger, Monroe Still, and I loved her Miami apartment. And Miami's hot, probably comparable, but Kinshasa is definitely hotter. Um, and she seemed to love the waffle blanket that she had, and so I was definitely influenced and copped one of my own. So I am so excited to be using one of these. Um, and I got it in white, it's 100% cotton. It's very, very lightweight, but it does like feel like a blanket at the same time, which is perfect for like those Kinshasa nights when it is gonna rain. Um, this is gonna be a really good alternative. And yes, people, this is another episode in perspiration. What are we gonna do? <laughs> I'm gonna use this Zara Oriental uh, perfume that's actually pretty much done. I think I have just like one or two sp spray foams in it. Um, and I'm gonna just spray my bed. Cause I like a really nice smelling bed. And now I can get rid of it. 
I got feeling guilty of wasting. Okay, that's done. This is the Zara Oriental one I'm showing you. And it is so, so good. I got this for like less than 25 bucks at the Zara store and never complained. Okay, so next up, I am going to set up um, what my side table is gonna look like. And I don't really have any physical like nightstands or side tables, but I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna use. Um, so I went to uh, Kuwait for a wedding. Oh my God, how many years ago? Maybe four or five years ago. And I got this stool. Isn't she pretty? And what I'm gonna do is I want to pile a couple of books onto this. And there are books that I've read and some books that I would like to read. And then there are also some cookbooks that I love. Uh, and so that's what I'm gonna be doing. I'm gonna have that as my temporary nightstand slash dresser slash just something to look pretty at the edge of the bed. All right, let's style it up. Hola mis amor, I'm just wrapping up a couple of things here on my phone. I got my bed done as you saw and I hate like sitting on my bed so I'm like doing this super quick so I can straighten it out. My elder sister used to be this way and when we were kids I hated it because it was I just want to exist in the bed but she was very much like do not sit on the bed I just made and now I am that person so thanks Iren. Um, anyway, I do want to show you this cute phone case that I have been using. It's just from Amazon but I love it. I have the iPhone 12 Pro Max and I figured I would share because she's so pretty. Um, and then I wanted to also show you, show you uh, this candle that I have had. Do you see how it is still nicely sealed and packaged? Literally has been in my luggage since I moved from Boston in August of 2020. And we're in January of 2022. Yes, I have kept things that long sealed for this very moment. I'm very excited. So let's open this up it's a candle so there's like no crazy surprise but the scent guys i don't know if i've shown you no i did show you the scent in my cloth it is the dw home uh santal mask and i'll leave that link down below but for my bedroom i am going to be using or lighting the puny bloom it's also by DW Home. This is one of my favorite um, candle brands. And I love the packaging, as you guys can see. The packaging is great. It's this like pinkish color. Oh my God. Guys, this is like how you want to go to sleep, how you want to wake up, how you want your atmosphere to be at all times. Oh, it says a bouquet of peony petals intertwined with pear, apricot, and pink poppies, softened with white woods. <sighs> this sounds like a hug. <sighs> okay, so this is supposed to burn for 33 hours, and I don't know if we're gonna make 33 hours because I just love burning candles, but I'm excited that she made it with me across the pond. It's one wick, by the way. And I think I'll just have her on that shelf over there. But yeah, oh my God. Oh my God, you guys, before I forget, right? So I've shown you the candle. This is my candle lighter. Isn't that cool? Look at the rose gold. Forgive my nails, but isn't that? So fancy. So it's from a company called the Game Ball. And it has an on off switch and a place where you can charge it with the USB. And then once you turn it on, you can see the display come on. And then now you have full visibility into battery life, which is 
perfect. So I'm just gonna go ahead and light this baby up. I'm so happy. Let the scents begin. And I just remembered that along with my DW Home candle, I had actually ordered two candles from Hyatt Rita and oh my god I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly she's incredible she's an, an actual boss I love following her Instagram if you don't know who she is she's a social media strategist she works at Meta and um, she started a candle line I want to say it was last year or maybe the year before that um, called Aya Candle and I have been waiting to get my hands on her candles here in Kinshasa and they're finally here guys they're literally finally here so what does that mean that means I'm gonna unbox them with you guys as a way to wrap up my day um, this is also going to be part of my setup for my bedroom and I just figured I would show you guys what the candles look like there's always traffic in Kinshasa anyway let's get these babies open um, oh actually before I get to cutting through the packaging I just wanted to show you how um, they were delivered oh and just to be clear this did not come to Kinshasa I had a friend of mine bring them over from when she was in the States so I did not have delivery in Kinshasa do not let's just to clarify just to be clear <laughs> uh, so let's talk about the packaging because I told my friend who did an awesome job thank you piss this again um, to bring it in as a complete package as possible and so I'm going to unbox this just as though it came in the mail um, so you see the very fragile sticker there but my best detail here is how she has her name on the box I think that's so incredible you don't really find many companies that um, think about detail to that degree where they look at even how the delivery box is gonna look like so I thought that was just incredible such a touch of class and luxury that to me is just chef's kiss Hyatt chef's kiss okay so I'll make sure to link the candles below as well in the event that you guys want to shop them but oh my god I'm just so excited let's get to looking at what they look like Oh, I guess that was upside down. Hold on, hold on. Please hold. Oh, wow, guys, look. This is how it comes from. So she has her name on there. And then you see some of the packaging. Wow. Oh, this is such a good experience. Like, I love the experience. Hold on, I'm put There we go. I love the experience of unboxing. And to me, Oh my god and it actually smells good and just for context I got this delivered in October no in November so my friend brought this for me from the States in November and it's January it still smells good Wow okay um, so this is a little pouch and you can see her name is on the packaging and it's a little pouch <sighs> oh wow I literally watched her stories as she sh took us through the journey of how she shot this campaign which i absolutely loved wow it's the thoughtfulness for me everything is a fragrant do you understand fragrant wow that is so impressive i'm just a little paranoid because they just made this bed so i'm gonna I'm do this off camera and then i'll come right back oh also look at what it says on the box here because you deserve nice things. I love that. I'm telling you, it's the luxury for me. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh, hold on. Oh wow. Oh my God. Oh, uh-oh. <laughs> Here's the candle. So this is the candle, this is what it comes in. 
Oh, wow. It says Feru's right here. Oh my God. Oh. Oh my, it smells super familiar. <laughs> I don't know if you guys ever get that feeling. Oh my gosh, and the candle holder is iridescent. Iridescent, iridescent, iridescent. That's how you say it. Hola mis amor, it is a new day here in Kinshasa and we are shopping. Shop. They must say hi. Hi. <laughs> so guys, every week we buy water, and every week my dad is upset about it. I don't know. Don't take pictures of cars. Mainly. Nobody's taking pictures of cars, Papa. Papa, because you're not telling the truth. 11,000. Papa, because it wasn't true. Why do you not tell me that? And then the whole night, 20 times, when that coin in Egypt was who do you go and do? Why are you vexed about the fact that I like to keep the door closed? It's my door. Open, you are free. I understand I'm free, but that doesn't mean we have to keep the door no, open. Oh my god, Papa, I'm not sleeping with the door open. <laughs> what is this? Is he really out here fighting me over sleeping with the door closed? This is what happens when you go back and you live at home, guys. It's like it's his door. Listen, I'm not I'm not I'm not fighting that, but can I live though? Can I pick when I want a door open and close? Like what? Oh my god. Ten. There are ten of them. Eh? If you're gonna take the Papa, before we were not budgeting you in this purchase. Oh my god. Okay. I'm just trying to not fight with my father in the store and it is difficult guys. It is difficult being somebody's child, you understand? Um lemon. Oh my god y'all, these are literally my favorite. They're ginger and lemon. We eat like four packs of these. It's actually pretty crazy. Oh, and they have them today. This is a good day. 